looking at another dead after a roadside argument in Tuscaloosa County. Well, we first reported this story as breaking news Monday at 10. It happened at a busy area just off Interstate 2059. CBS 42 News reporter Tim Marie joins us now from our Tuscaloosa newsroom with the latest on the investigation and what people in that community are saying. It's, it's shocking. It's really sad. Some area residents are both concerned and surprised that gunfire Monday night took one man's life and the suspect who pulled the trigger is behind bars. We have a good community here. And when you hear something like this, it's just devastating because it's not something that happens every day. The shooting happened around 515 Monday evening at exit 100 at Interstate 2059 near the exit ramp. 39-year-old Robert Arwood was shot several times. He later died at the hospital. Investigators arrested 44-year-old Matthew Wilson and are charging him with capital murder. Investigators tell us the victim thought he recognized the other man from a previous incident between the two. So he got out of his car and approached the other vehicle. Words were exchanged and shots were fired. Metro homicide officers say this shooting could possibly be a result of road rage. We believe there was a previous incident within the last month in a nearby parking lot where the suspect's vehicle struck the victim's vehicle and the victim recognized the suspect from that incident. Wilson faces capital murder charges because he was sitting in a vehicle when he allegedly shot the victim. Mr. Arwood exited his vehicle and approached Mr. Wilson's vehicle and as he approached the vehicle, uh, he was shot multiple times. Suspect Matthew Wilson is being held in jail without bond. In Tuscaloosa County, Tim Reed, CBS 42 News.